Nail addicts, let's paint courage. Grab your favorite liner brush and a light purple gel polish. Drawing a bean shape, we're gonna add his body and then right here is his little cheek area and go ahead and fill that in. Next, get your white liner gel. We're gonna be drawing two ovals with the little tops cut off because that's where his eyebrows are gonna be going later. Save this and try in your next nail design because I know you can do it. Next, we're gonna draw out his little mouth area over here and taking a brown gel polish, we're just gonna draw out his little nose area. Now we're gonna draw his little legs, just two little slanted lines, a dotting tool with three little toes. Draw out his little arms. And now going in with your favorite black liner gel, we're gonna draw out his little eyebrow and start outlining his eyes. After outlining most of the top part of his head, go ahead and outline the other eye, leaving this little tail down here to give him that worried Courage the Cowardly Dog look. Now we're going in on the nose. After you've drawn out the nose, you wanna cut off some of that brown and fill it in, leaving a little line at the top to give it some dimension. Little swoop de doop over here for his mouth. And now this is the roughest part. If you can get this part down, we're good to go. After the mouth, it's smooth sailing. Draw up the little tongue area and connect it right here. Now listen here. I know this looks a little intimidating, but I promise if you just do it step by step, you got this. I don't know about you guys, but this show used to freak me out, honey. But I just couldn't get enough of it, and I still love it. Now we're outlining the little feetsies. We gotta add a little spot on the side of them right here. And then load your brush for a really thin line because we're gonna do a little chin. Now we don't got much room, but we're gonna add whatever we can fit of his ears. After doing the ears, we're gonna do three little dots by his nose. Now let's fill in the teeth the mouth and the tongue. Now we gotta add two small little ovals inside of the white on his eyes. And of course, we gotta put the lines on his teeth and then a little hair on his face. Add a little bit of a tail and then add two white dots in his eyes. Now you could be done, but uh, no. Let's add a little bit of shading. Using my black shading gel, I'm just gonna give it some dimension with the shading gel. It's crazy how this little bit of shading can make it look so much cooler. Now we're gonna top coat it, wipe it, and look! You just painted courage. Who should we paint next?